Bonjour. A little backwards here. Have you ever tried to eject a volume or a disc or flash drive or whatnot out of Mac OS X and have it say, no, you can't eject it. Well, I'm going to teach you something new. First off, if you're lucky, here will be the sequence of events where it will actually tell you what application has it open. So, I've got this USB drive and I'm going to edit my awesome file just so it's open. So, if I go over here to the finder and actually try to eject it, and we wait, and we wait some more, the disk passport couldn't be ejected because item is using it. Great! Now I know what application to look at. But I ran into something last night that, for whatever reason, I think it was because it was a daemon thing related to iCloud, if I remember right, what not. It did not tell me what. But, lucky me, I remembered my awesome Unix skills or something. L-S-O-F. List open files, that's what you need to know about. Volumes. Passport. And how do I know that? Because it's called that. And that's where your mounted disks or your USB drives end up is in volumes. Right, so you do that. And then you get a list. And you, then you'll be like... Vim, okay, and then Z shell apparently as well. Vim, all oh, right, I remember where I had that open, so then I do just quit out of that. Well, oh, right, <laughs> step number two. You know, this is why I should have rehearsed. You know, if you are miffing about, that's probably not the word of the command line, you might forget to actually get out of the directory. And then you go, boom. And now, all is well. Now the thing is ejected. So, again, if the finder it does not help you out and does not tell you what the application is, you can use LSOF. If you're familiar with the LS command, hopefully you don't need to memorize that part and just remember open files, LSOF, and then the path to the volume. So, yeah. And then it will tell you what is what is accessing it? And then you can just go kill those processes, processes, tell them to go sort off or something, and then you'll be happy as a clam. Is that an expression? I'm not sure. Anyway, hope that was helpful. If not, pfft, what not?